Hey guys, I'm back with another video. I'm going to talk to you about this, okay? First off, do you guys all know when your teacher says to you, Okay, welcome now to third year. Junior, sir. I'm sorry, did you say junior, sir? Oh no, I better get ready for college. God, this means everything to me. Right, come on the fuck. We need to win this game. Okay, this is my year now. I have to make my parents proud. I have to study non-stop. I have to give up what I like in life and study so hard to get full-on A's. Eh, wrong. Take a breather. Okay. The junior cert, right? is only to for you to understand how the system works of the points there that you need so like higher ordinary foundation level whatever it is any subject there higher ordinary or foundation level whatever it is okay always do your best in it there right that's all you can do right you could study for a buttload of hours, right? And then now print something now on the on the p piece of paper. Now, the president of the United States of America said whatever he said, and done. That's and that's only the first page. Do you know what I mean? You know, and then what about the second page? Oh God, I studied all night for this. God, I'm such a loser. God, my God. How many coffees did you drink tonight? I don't know, like a cocoa, like six. You know? God, um, um, okay, geography. Maybe I can pass this one. Um, the rain goes down, down on the ground and then it goes up again. It goes up then by steam. Yeah, that's correct. And what else? Um, can't remember what else. That's all I know. And you've been studying for how long? Well, I had to study every single thing there in one day. I have to. I had to study for eight hours there or six hours there. I had to knock off my dinner sometimes just to, to get all the good grades. Don't be doing that. You're wasting your goddamn time. Okay? That's like everyone talking to you at once. And you're only going to hear... One conversation with that person. So there's five people shouting at you. Loud and clear. Loud and clear. Five times there. You're going to hear different things from different people. And then you get it all mixed and jumbled. Because you could have your history work there. That you know for your English there. So it's like English comes in. You're writing down all the history stuff on English paper. You know what I mean? Or even Irish for a uh, Spanish level. There, you're writing things in Irish for Spanish, and then Spanish then for Irish. You know what I mean? That's how fucked up people's brains get when it comes to the junior certs. Always is, always has been, and always will be. Okay? Because teachers do not say, okay, okay, it's actually a pre test. There, it actually doesn't really count. It doesn't count. Okay? When you're doing your, your junior cert, right? It's just for you to get on well, do your tests there, write every single detail that you have in your brain, and then at the end of the uh, month or whatever it is of the summertime, in third year, they'll look at your things there, okay, A, B, C, D, whatever grade that you get, you go back into there, that, into that uh, school, Nice and proud. You for almost forget that you actually did the junior cert level. And then you actually look at your thing there. Whoa. God, I got like seven honours there. This is magnificent there. I thought I did shit, to be honest. What'd you get it, get it in? Got seven honours there. I did all ordinary there or all higher there. Oh my God. And then you know then... God, if I actually st st uh, do this uh, studying for sixth year, there, I'm definitely going to college. Fantastic job. That's what it's all about, right? 
It's something to do with being like, oh, how many points do you, do you get in your leave, in your junior search? Do you know what I mean? It's none of that. It's just writing down something there and then wait then until it comes to fourth year or if you're doing skipping a year to fifth year, whatever it is, right? You look at your piece of paper then, wow, look at the grades there. You put in all this hard work and then you'll be saying to yourself, Wait a second, so if I get this in the Leaving Cert then, that means that I'm going to college there or doing whatever, I need this, this amount of grades for for something else. So you have another two years then, so you have fourth year, fifth year, sixth year then, to think about what do you want to do to achieve your goal after secondary school is all over, once you're done, your Leaving Cert. Do you know what I mean? It all repair, prepares you for the leaving cert the junior cert prepares you for the leaving cert and the mocks is actually harder than the actual junior cert not the other way around as in because it doesn't make sense whatsoever do you know what I mean oh god the mocks are so easy oh god so easy piece of cake I did that in half an hour even though the test was for two hours you know no wrong the mocks is always hard right and there even be tricky ones even though they actually are simple simple enough but people get it in their head god i have to get this right i have to must get right nothing about it i have to get right you know what i mean you don't just take your time there in an ordinary test you'll be flying it you know people actually lose their shit when they see the first paper of the english paper there they look at the marks. I caramba, I won't be getting that if my skin cured cancer, as people would be saying in their heads, you know? Or even, God, I can't even get a gr girlfriend if skin skin cured cancer, you know? It'd be the exact same thing in your head you'd be saying, you know? And people actually lose their crap over the uh, junior certs. Junior certs is only to prepare you for the leaving certs. That is it. Then once that's done there, you look at your yoke there in the leaving cert. Wow, I actually got 20 marks higher than the junior cert. This is magnificent. That's a big improvement. Some other people can get another 100 marks better. Do you know what I mean? You know, it, it, it all depends on you. Not your friends there. Never mind what they get. Focus on you. If you can focus on you in your junior search, your basically your entire life in secondary school for your doing your homework on time, get everything right there. Don't doss around in secondary school. If you want to be uh, very, very good and achieve all these goals, like I want to be a billionaire there, well, you have to go into secondary school, do well in your junior search and do well in your leaving. You're leaving then leads you on to the next thing in life, the next step, right? That is it, which is fantastic, right? And another thing I'm going to say is that the junior certs don't even count whatsoever. They bring it out to a different teacher there, right? And then just say if you got two fails, to say uh, one in maths there, just say one in a subject they kind of like, right? Or even three subjects there, three of them fails there, right? Doesn't really matter whatsoever because when it comes to the leaving cert there, you have to put in all the effort. Your parents won't be saying, oh, hey, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. We'll give you an extra 200 marks there just to make you go to college. Doesn't work that way whatsoever. You have to put your heart and soul into that there, into those pa pen and paper there. And then after that, then once you're done, you're done. After that, then when people say to you, when you walk out of that hall or that classroom, whatever you're uh, doing, your entry, your leaving certs, right? People can't say nothing then, right? You can't say, oh God, I hope I did well. Well, the proof is there now. Proof is in the pudding, as people say, you know what I mean? doesn't matter if you can uh, 
studied very hard. Proof is in the pudding. You know what I mean? And another thing as well. Don't you don't need to study mad crap, right? If you study like you have your ordinary homework there, right? That probably takes what half an hour. Okay, then go. Then you're going to do another two hours of uh, doing your own uh, thing there of uh, doing looking up for English there. I need to stu study this. I need to study um, history, geography, art, whatever it is. Don't only do one subject per day, and then. The end of the week then, that's five days, that's five subjects there, like that. And then write down little notes and all that there. Everyone does these things, right? And then when it comes to a uh, classroom test there, they're also on the leave certs as well. You may not think it, but they are. The teachers actually know what is actually on those junior cert papers already, right? But they won't tell you face to face because they get paid to keep their mouths shut absolutely correct right because like they wouldn't be even telling you they wouldn't be sorry they wouldn't even be teaching you what's on the test on the test do you know what i mean to be honest think about it for a sec am i correct yes of course i am i went through the whole system you know what i mean i do i lost my shit when i was in uh third year there I was like, holy shit, I need to get my head down here now and absolutely tear into this piece of junk there to get my grades up. And then it turns out it wasn't about the grades whatsoever. It's just like to prepare you for the leaving cert. The leaving cert is the big key. It doesn't matter if you actually missed two to three exams for a third year and didn't even show up. It doesn't matter. But it does matter when it comes to the Leaving Cert. Leaving Cert there, they will call the guards nearly or even call your parents. Hey, is your son home? Is he? Is he? Uh, he is why? Is he not coming in for his Irish exam? I'll speak to him right now. Hold on. Hey. Yes. Don't you have an um, exam tonight? Oh shit, I forgot. Yes. <sighs> and I'm paying for college for you. You know what I mean? So thanks very much for watching. I hope you got loads of tips and tricks there. And do not lose your shit about the junior cert. Junior certs do not count. But the reason why they have the junior certs is that just to see how smart you are, then... In three years time then, fourth year, fifth year, sixth year then, you do everything there to get into first year college life freshman year. And then once that's done then, you'll be like, well, so that's why the, that's why we had um, the leaving certs. Exactly. You know what I mean? Thanks very much for watching.